Hey, Elwood City Sports fans, this is Thad Sturgeon uh, from Elwood City Sports along with head basketball coach Dan Bradley. Coach Bradley, thank you for the time as we get ready to kick off this 2023-2024 uh, season. Many of our viewers know you as uh, being a football coach here the last couple of years, yeah. stepping up to the plate and being basketball coach this year. Talk a little bit about maybe how that came about uh, for the opportunity, head coach. Uh, yeah, uh, coach stepped down kind of late in the season and um, you know, Kurt asked me if I'd be interested. I kind of delayed my response. Uh, he followed up with me a couple times. I agreed to go through the process and you know, things kind of worked out and here I am. Oh, great. Um, you've coached basketball before. Maybe give our viewers a little bit of uh, insight on your previous basketball. I don't know if I want to share that. Is that uh, <laughs> at Avonworth, or, or, or one of yeah, our that's, rivals. <laughs> that's, um, yeah, that's a big one. Yes, yeah, so I, I was the varsity coach there for 10 years, coached um, ninth grade for a number of years mm -hmm. there, uh, 25 years in total. Mm -hmm. And um, when my daughter graduated, I was going to see her play at Allegheny College. And, you know, things kind of took a curve there as well with concussions. And oh. so um, kind of free to coach right now. Oh, there you go. As, and you've coached before both football and basketball at the same time. So Absolutely. this is something that's not no. not uh, not new to you. You've been successful at uh, other places. Um, last year, the season basketball season, fifteen and seven or fifteen and eight, made it into that first round of the playoffs. Um, did not lose many seniors last year uh, via graduation. As you've worked with this team here for the last probably couple months, what have you seen out of your? Uh, now seniors moving in. They're a good group. Um, you know, a good group of seniors, naturally, you know, led by Joe Roth, Joseph mm -hmm. Roth, who's a dynamic, just a dynamic player in person. Um, our other seniors have, have grown and developed uh, through the fall leagues and workouts and open gyms. And uh, Ricky Roth, assistant coach, has done a great okay. job of getting the guys in the gym in the summertime as the transition uh, finally took place. But um, uh, Colton, Kreiser, uh, Nate Williams and uh, Ryan uh, mm -hmm. Wid. Yeah, we, yeah. I, we, I, I, for some reason, <laughs> I was calling him Wid today. I'm mean, at Ryan today, where he's always been uh, Wid. But um, uh, they've grown a lot uh, in in the style and tempo and accountability that we want to play with, and having everybody be able to contribute. Uh, is something that we're shooting for. And I'm sure you have some underclassmen that got a lot of playing time last year, too, stepping up. A lot, a lot of guys. And, 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 you know, even with other players uh, being involved with, with Colton in cross country and Chris in football, a lot of younger guys had the opportunity uh, to play more and out of position. You know, Chucky, Will, uh, even our younger guys going okay. down to Keith and Caleb, who are freshmen. So a lot of opportunity for, for the guys to see. And I'm sure you'll be looking for contribution from, it don't matter what grade they're in, you want no. contribution from everybody. Absolutely. If you're so. on the floor, we expect you to, to do something. <laughs> right. Um, you know, the section, you know, we're looking at the same schedule as last year. Um, you know, you got some really good teams in there. Is there some teams that you're really looking out for the teams to to beat or I, I wouldn't say we're looking out for them I, I, I'd like to think that we'll be better prepared uh, knowledge wise and be able to take advantage of some of the things that uh, other teams do with Nishanik's trapping of Joseph mm -hmm. High and trying to convert that into layups uh, being able to handle pressure against Newcastle a team we're playing this year mm -hmm. uh, hopefully prepares for the playoffs and, and, and just the conference or the section in general is a competitive section All right, it, cer it certainly is um, scrimmage game is coming tomorrow. up here tomorrow 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 to get a, get a handle on where it's at so coach Bradley thank you for your time as thank always um, our schedule uh, will be on the it is on the Elwood City uh, Wolverines website and of course uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel Elwood City Sports Elwood City Wolverines is that YouTube channel to catch all the uh, all the games that we broadcast this year uh, both boys girls and uh, other uh, winter sports as well this is Thad Sturgeon thank you